yet, boys. Oh my god, Dad. Look at all these elk. Just got to our hunting spot. And there is there is a pile of elk. It's uh, 7 o'clock in the morning. And we got some elk just to the right of us on a hilltop. So we're going to see if we can knock one of the cows down. It's December 27th. Beauty. And it's minus 20 outside. And we got more elk to the back up on this ridge. There's a bunch of elk back there. That, then that's shit out of luck. Shit out of luck. Unless that's the grazing lease, then we might be. I don't know. They might not be. Like, sure, they're running hard, but like a couple of them, they're. They might just run to the other side. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Take a breather. <coughs> I think we just need to go up and over. Onto that. Get onto that road and come around. Yeah. Yeah, like they're running hard out of those trees. Still elk up in the ass. It's uh, January 13th and uh, we're going out trying to fill dad's cow elk tag again. Temperature is definitely warmed up. It's plus two right now with a slight breeze. 
I expect it to get a little brighter and uh, a little windier as the day progresses. I think today is going to be the day that dad dumps his cow elk, so it's going to be a wild ride. no elk as of yet. It's really bright out here though. Forgot my sunglasses. Just haven't seen any fresh tracks. Nothing. No fresh sign. They're obviously not in this part of the country so I'll be heading back to the truck soon to go check out another area hopefully. <laughs> As you can see, the snow is pretty deep up here, so we're just going back on the same trail we made coming in to our spot. But yeah, it's some spots gets up to knee deep, but we're probably pushing about a foot at least. So on our walk out just now, looked across the way, and there's a bunch of elk over there. They're out sunning themselves so I'm hoping they can't be seen from the road. They're on a stock to find some elk. They're just about an hour away from us which we spotted so we'll try our stock and the time is 10 to 12 and we hope to find find a hope to knock down one of those cow elk that are sitting over there. But we got a good hour hike. There's probably 75 head right now up there. His health isn't the best with his hip and all, so I'm really hoping we can just one and done this now. And
What do you guys say to the camera? What do I gotta say to the camera? <laughs> Next time. That's a true hunter. We all do miss. And here's a prime example. But at least I had a crack at one and uh, the elk won this time. Well, we got one more weekend to give her, so we'll try again next Saturday and see if we can fill her tag on a different piece of property. But at least we're out here working. We've already done 11 kilometers today so far, and we're probably still another five from the truck. Yeah, we checked for blood and made sure that she wasn't hit. No evidence, so we're going to go home. And tend to her wounds. And tend to her wounds and not worry about it. It's that's hunting. That is what it is hunting. We're all human and we all miss. found her elk right now. We're going for them. We're downwind. They're in the bottom probably 2,000 yards. So we'll keep you posted. But it's it's game on. This is third for the charm. We see some elk. We try to do a stalk on them. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned. This is the end of our 2017-2018 uh, cow elk season, our late season. Today is uh, January 20th, 2018. We uh, managed to get out uh, three times elk hunting this year. We were unsuccessful. I still have my tag, but uh, some people think that's a bad thing being uh, unsuccessful. But in uh, I look at it different. Uh, we we built uh, memories, and uh, we had uh, good friendship made up. And uh, I got to go out with uh, my sons, Neil and James, today. Uh, I like to thank uh, James for taking me out the last three times. He did the guiding. He did the filming. Uh, we had a fellow with us uh, the first time. His name was Isaac, a friend of James. He came out with us. Uh, every time we went out, we had elk. We were on to elk. Uh, either uh, we got uh, spoiled by other hunters or Mother Nature, like today, didn't help us all that well with all the wind. So again, 
that's an update for the elk season for 217, 218. And they did beat us this year, but we will be out next this uh, 2018. And we'll get back to you and hopefully knock one down.